Dear guests, colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this commemoration of the World Fish Days that FL is jointly organizing with the Holy See. World Fish Day was established by fish frog associations to celebrate a profession that supports the livelihood of 10% of the world's population. While well, providing safe and nutritious food for billions of consumers, the sector also suffers from various problems ranging from overfishing, illegal, unreported, unregulated fishing, human rights violations within the sector, unsafe working conditions. FL and the Holy Seas have a long standing relationship in addressing these problems. 2020 has seen an additional threat to the sector the COVID-19 pandemic. The pandemic has had a devastating impact on many parts of the sector. Fishers could not go to sea because of travel restrictions. Landing could not be sold because of transport and the market closures. Physical distance made the working on board vessels sometimes impossible, and the monitoring programs suffered. In response, FAO has launched the holistic comprehensive FAO COVID-19 response and recovery program. The program aims to mitigate the immediate impact while strengthening the long-term resilience of agri-food systems and livelihoods in line with the UN approach, build to transfer, and in pursuit of the sustainable development goals. Together with the World Bank, we assess the impact of the pandemic on sector in several countries and identify adequate mitigation measures. These studies have resulted in funding proposal for dedicated interventions which are being finalized. This includes providing credit for fishers, enhance their marketing opportunities, supporting online sales of their products, and building capacity along the value chain for improve the process drying, packaging, and waste management. We are inspired by wise words of encouragement Pope Francis shared with the seafarers amid the trials caused by the COVID-19 in his video message of 17 June. And we stand in solidarity with all those working at sea. We pay tribute to them as they continue to make many sacrifices to bear the heavy better. Long period spent aboard ships without being able to disembark, separated from families, friends, far from their home countries, and fearing infections. Today, we will hear directly from the fishers on the actual impact the pandemic has had on their livelihoods and their working conditions. I'm certain that we can all learn a lot from them, and we are honored that also this year, the message of Holy See on the occasion of World Fishers Day will be read out during this event. There is a Chinese proverb which says that giving a man a fish, you feed him for a day. Teaching them to fish will feed them for a lifetime. As a knowledge organization, FL will continue working hard for those engaged in the fishers and aquaculture sector. Through the policy consultation, information dissemination, technical assistance, capacity building, with determination, hope, and gratitude. I thank you.